Right guys, hello and welcome back to another video. Today, what we're going to be doing is something that we've done before once or twice in the past. Now, you may remember a video where I went through and reviewed some of the YouTubers outside of the skateboarding niche that maybe went into and tried to learn how to kickflip or a different trick of some sort of description and tried to do it within like a day, 24 hours, 48 hours, whatever it may be. I've done a couple of reviews of that footage before. Some of them seem legit, some of them seem like they already had skateboard knowledge beforehand and then just decided to do the kickflip and then just like build the video around already being able to do a kickflip. So there are a few of those already on my channel. But today I noticed a few people have actually brought a different one to my attention that I haven't seen before. Now I did click on the video quickly just to see if it was something worth looking into and it does seem that it's definitely worth a video. So this is going to be a pretty good one, a pretty interesting one in my opinion. This is the video right here. So I tried to learn kickflip in a day. It's by Buzz BuzzFeed multiplayer. So with all that being said, the fact that it's from BuzzFeed should be entertaining enough. But yeah, let's jump in and see if this is actually a real or a fake kind of I learned to kickflip in a day type of video. And then by the end of the video, we'll give it a realness rating out of five Tonys. Let's full screen this and jump straight when in. When I was a kid, I wanted nothing more than to be able to kickflip. I thought it looked so cool, but I couldn't get past the mental hurdle. Though the kickflip is a very basic trick, it can be very challenging for a new skater. For this True. trick, the rider flips their skateboard 360 degrees midair along the axis of the nose and the tail of the deck. If you can land this trick, you're starting to become a real skater. So I quit, <laughs> like most kids do. Never picked it up again. Now I'm 28 years old. Oh, no way, same. I'm also 28 years old. I'm gonna try and make this happen today. So I invited my friend Alex, best skateboarder I know. Oh, stop it. He really is. Okay, Alex is at the barracks. Can you show us a, a kick? And he just about got a pop shove it. So hopefully, hopefully he can teach my man how to kickflip. Flip really quick? Yeah. You can't guarantee first try. Yeah. It's decent. Like the board hit the floor before he attached to it, but for like a non-skater skater, it's pretty good still. Damn, I would love to walk out of here today doing that. What are the odds of that? What are the odds in the next three to four hours I can do that? It took me about two weeks of just being on the street, in my driveway, doing it constantly. When I was a kid, the first time I ever asked someone how to kickflip, they gave me like the cliff notes, and then I literally stood in the same place in the skate park for like 12 hours. I think I got there at like 8 a.m. and didn't leave till around 8, 9 p.m., just trying it attempt after attempt after attempt, grinding it out. And I never even got close, and then about three months, I landed it. So. I'm admittedly I was quite a slow learner especially as a kid but it definitely takes a lot of time and some of the most talented people in sports that I've ever met some younger kids some older people take days weeks months to learn it I've never seen anybody in my entire life start learning kickflip and then within a day have landed it or within a week have landed it so already my back is up bam I missed the first few attempts. Okay, he's doing all these. Let me put on that helmet. Safety As first. As a kid, I thought it was impossible. So if I were to land it today, I mean, that would be incredible. Uh, a couple things you need to know about before doing a kickflip. One, you need to learn how to ollie. The, the motion of just kicking your tail down and pushing your foot forward is what you need to do in a kickflip. Well, funny enough, actually, the video we reacted to the other day when we were talking about the surf stare, that girl that um, was getting the, the hate for doing that Olympic video, basically she told us she learned how to kickflip before anything else and just skipped the ollie. So maybe that's not true what he's just saying, but I would always recommend learning the ollie first, of course. It's the most fundamental basic trick, but there are tons of other stuff you can do in between. This down, boom, should flip. And you'll leave your foot out <laughs> until it's time to catch it. Yeah. A big part of it is visualizing the trick. Bro, homie's tips were, yeah, you just pop, kick, flick out, wait for the board to stop flipping, catch it, land, roll away clean. It's literally as simple as that. Could it get any easier? Obviously, he's going to land it now. You can visualize yourself doing it. Got to achieve it. First try. Here we go. What is this framing? Oh. Oh. Nailed it. Good. Pause. One, two. Not like a boom. Hey. Mm. Pushing it down more than you're pushing it out. Okay. 
So you're in a good enough spot right now where I think I can let you try it out. Okay. I can come back in like 45 minutes. I'll see you <laughs> back here in a little bit. Sweet, dude. Thanks, man. Skate or die. <laughs> that is a super common thing that you see of new skaters as well, like touching the ground before they pop. Very common. Let me just try I feel like if you touch the ground, just quick. reset. Okay, like to do that, just to do that, where you can like flick the board and let it flip and not land on it, took me weeks. Weeks. So the fact that within like a couple of minutes, he's just doing like the perfect kickflip form. You've got me, you've got me doubting this quite heavily. Whoa. I'm already getting tired, I'm already getting sweaty. See, that was a perfect form. 17 attempts. Let's try heel flip. Here we go. All right, time out. Can't overthink it. Jesus Christ. Bro, how? How can you have gotten that close just 40 attempts in? He literally landed one foot on and the front foot just slightly slipped off at the last second. Like you've got me, you've got me very suspicious for someone that's never done a skateboard trick before. My goodness, Matt. If I would have just landed with my front foot on the board, See what I, mean? I would have gotten it. Right now I'm making progress, so I'm gonna continue to do what I'm doing. Um, Alex, you outside? Come on in. I saw your shadow. You just missed it. I flipped it once to where my back foot landed on it. But you got a full flip. Full flip. Of the one foot down. Yeah. Bro, by like, if we watch his ankle here, if we go frame by frame. So like, if we watch his front foot here, like the technique and like the strength of the ankle, which in my opinion, the ankle like flick is a strength or a muscle that you kind of have to build up. It's not just something that happens like that. Like watch his front foot. He hits the flick slightly off frame, but he hits it kind of perfectly right off that front bit. Board goes all the way around. He's already bringing that foot back to get to the top of the grip tape again. And then he just stops. At this point where the foot is already traveling back to get on top of the grip tape again, it seems as though he just decides, okay, I'm not gonna take the foot any further and just lets it fall and just lets it fall beside the board. Yeah. I just couldn't get both down. Let's see it. Let's see you try one. I want to. I want to see how far you've gone. Now that my teacher's here, I'm getting. Uh, hey. I'm getting nervous now. See what I mean? Like, bro, that is not something that just spawns in after 42 attempts. That's like half an hour of practice, if that. It was like that. That's nice. where it was. Yeah. Wow. You're getting the flipping motion down. You're keeping it under your body. And this guy seems. This guy seems like he's in on something. I can't lie. Maybe this is just me being suspicious, but this guy in the floral shirt, he seems like he's in on this and he's like not really like too enthusiastic about it. He's kind of like, you're just trying to fake how to learn how to kickflip and I don't really want to be a part of it. But yeah, you, you seem like you're getting the flipping motion. I don't know. I think I'm just being overly suspicious maybe here. Playing devil's advocate, could it be possible? At the end of the day, every trick is just a roll of the dice and eventually you are going to land on the number that you predict. But still, this skateboarding really isn't that simple. It's just all, you got to suck up those knees. <laughs> In there. Also, I'm just going to not tell you any more tips until I talk to you again. Okay. Because... I think like one of the things about doing this trick, there is a lot of steps, but at the end of the day, it is like just one, it should just be one fluid motion. Gotcha. Good luck. Like as well, Bye. as someone who learns tricks all the time, being told or knowing what you have to do, even if I go into a trick knowing like, right, my back foot has to do this, my front foot has to do this, even though I know everything, how it goes down, in the order it should go down, doesn't mean my mind can communicate that to my legs to happen all in a perfect motion. So even if you know all the details, translating that to the body, completely different story. As I'm sure a lot of you guys have tried, you've seen a video where it says, to shove it, just kick back with your back leg. You're like, oh, well, it's not really that simple though, is it? But it's just practice at the end of the day. And this guy with 40 attempts hasn't had a lot of practice yet. Yeah. 
Like, come on. I'll be honest with you. I've got some forts. I'll get into the forts in a minute. And then two of those in a row, suspicious. On the ground. Oh my god! 65 attempts, bro. No way. Ain't no way. This is my theory, right? This is my 100% theory of me just being like, boop, 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 the conspiracy guy. This guy probably skated when he was like super young, 10, 12, 14 years old. Learned how to kickflip when he was super young. Hasn't touched the board since. BuzzFeed then come up with a video. They're like, all right, skateboarding's coming into trend now because this was filmed like when the skateboarding was like really in in the upward spiral. So they're like, oh, we've got to capitalize on this. Who here's got some skateboarding experience? Let's learn kickflip in a day. That's what it seems like to me. Obviously, I could be wrong. I'm always down for criticism when it comes to stuff like this, but this seems very, very suspicious, if not the most suspicious of all of them that I've watched so far. Give us a replay. Oh my God. <laughs> literally the cleanest kickflip and he's missing some of the very very common things that happen when you first land kickflips like one of the big things that people do when they first land kickflips is they flip the board and land with their feet dead close together the board either shoots out from underneath them or something happens along those lines where they like land it really sketchily or they're just on the tail and like the nose is in the air seeing this and how clean that kickflip was i'm going to run it back real quick god. oh my god Bro, that was so clean. That was actually so clean. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Bro. Oh, I did it! Let's get Alex in here and show him. I did it! There's no way. Yeah, and that seems super fake. Like, I don't know. I feel like I might be being just a bit too. A bit too. What's the word? critical in this one but my man seems like he's not legitimately stoked i don't know i feel like a bit of a dick for saying this stuff but i've seen a lot of people land their first kickflip and the excitement seems a lot more genuine than this brother hey, you've already done it there's no way And he looks like he knows man he literally looks like he's in on the guy he's like well you could do it before so you know? Watch this angle. Your face. Let's, let's break it down frame by frame here. Yes. Do we count it? Do we count that? What do you mean? You did it. Is that a real He looks like he's in on it for sure, man. So suspicious. Kick what? For sure. You did it, dude. It doesn't matter if your nose like kicks. It wasn't, you know, the most beautiful, but it was pretty good for your first try. So now- Bro, look at this guy's face. Look, that is not a well done for your first ever kickflip ever face. That's a you cheeky bastard face. So now I want to try it with you here to really, mm, you know. Yeah, you gotta, that's, the, that's the thing. Let's see you if you gotta make sure it wasn't luck. <laughs> Bro. All right, I think I've seen enough of this one. Honestly, the realness rating on this one, 1 1.5 out of 5 Tonys. If you guys have got any more videos like this you want me to check out, review, and have a look at, I'm more than happy to do so. Let me know, and I'll see you guys in the next one.